been out here today looking around, scouting this area. The new soldiers came through here during the war, and I just dug up under this root, as you can see right here. I knocked out the target. You can see it right there. Real nice shank on the back is, well, I've thrown it back in the hole. Real nice shank on the back. Flip it up there, you can see it. And on the front, I hope you can see that. It's a real nice little cuff button from the Civil War. We'll definitely take that. That's a good find, real good start for the day. I'm about 15 feet from where I found a little cuff button on this property a couple of weeks ago. I've been digging nothing but trash, but as you see right here, I've got another tiny little button. So it's got a shank on the back right there. I can't see the front. I'm going to attempt to brush this with a toothbrush right quick and then we'll take a peek at it and hopefully it's going to be another Civil War era button. I brushed what I could and all, I, all I've got right now is the back. I'm going to look through this dirt and hopefully you can see the shank through the back right there. Hopefully I'll be able to find the face of this little button. See part of a back mark right there. Hopefully the rest of it's going to be here in the dirt. I'm in an area right here I've dug a button and a button back in this area and this is five or ten feet from where I dug the last button back. I've got another good signal right here that hopefully will give us something good. The soil is extremely rocky right here in this area. Target's right here under a root. Try to make it loose. Target's right here in this dirt. Still showing button. There's the target. Not a button. Civil War round ball. Over here in the area where I found the button and button back the other day, and that pops a nice little rivet right here with real good looking green patina. Get it right here in the sun where you can see it. Real pretty green patina on it. Uh, fairly large rivet. Uh, I'll definitely take it. Get a real nice signal. Dug down an upturned piece of an old silver thimble. I'll definitely take that find. I was digging a hole, and in the hole there turned out to be a little bit of trash. This also came up out of the hole. A nice looking piece of a little bottle. I'm gonna <laughs> dig a little more and see if I can't find the rest of this thing. It's a decent find. Alright, just got a real good target right off an old road bed. If you'll look, you can see the way the road bed winds down through these pine trees right here. Got a good target I've dug down. I see the target in the hole. I haven't extracted it yet. To its button. I can see that right there. So if we can get it out and see what type of button we've got here. It's a two-piece button. Can't exactly make out what it is yet. Let me wipe it off just a little 
and see if we can't figure out what this is. I'm excited right now. I, I don't know if you can see that real good or not. There's a pair of cross cannons and a star right there. Not exactly sure what state that's from or if it's Yankee or Confederate, but let me tell you, I am excited right now. That is, uh, it's either cross cannons or cross sabers. I can't really tell yet. Uh, we'll be able to tell for sure when we get back to the house. Either way, that is one heck of a find right there. I am so excited right now. Just dug that real nice button just a little ways up from here and still on the side of this road bed. I just got another similar signal to what the button gave off. Hopefully, we'll see another one pop out of this hole right here in just a second. Target on this side of the hole. You can pop it out here. There's the target. It's another button. Shank is completely gone on this one. That appears to be a New York button. I can't really tell for sure, but I can almost see the shield right there in the middle I think we'll know more when we get that one to the house either way it's a good find 